Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm excited that you're here with me today for this Lips Collab. Yes, that's right. Today we're going to be looking at lips. I'm going to be showing you ways to make thin looks look bigger because if you've been on my channel for a while, you know that I'm a little bit lip challenged. And I am doing this collab with the beautiful Risa of Risa Does Makeup. She is a beautiful, fashionable YouTuber in her 40s. She's absolutely breathtaking. Another thing that makes her so special is that she is actually a real makeup artist. She was a working makeup artist for 20 years before she started her YouTube channel. And every time I watch one of her makeup looks and she does a million different looks, from daytime natural looks to nighttime glam, but whatever the look is, you know it's going to be absolutely perfectly executed and just watching her, you get some of those wonderful tips and learn how to do your makeup better. And I have improved my makeup skills just through watching Risa. And another thing that makes Risa's channel just perfect for us more grown up beauties is that she deals with hooded eyelids too. Yes, most of us, as we get to be a bit more mature, struggle with hooded eyelids. And Risa, amazingly enough, does too. But you would never know it to look at her because she has the perfect makeup tips to deal with her hooded eyes. In fact, she really helped me a lot in that area. And another thing that I particularly like about Risa is that she is just a real person. She's vulnerable at times, and she tells you what's really going on in her heart, what's really going on in her life, and that is so refreshing. Because when I watch a YouTube channel, to me it's a lot more than just watching an anchor on TV showing me how to do makeup. It's someone who shows me makeup, but also someone who shows me their heart, who shows me what's inside of them, who shows me a little bit of vulnerability, and Risa really does that. So when you go over to visit Risa's channel, I hope you'll tell her hello and subscribe to her channel. Okay, let's get down to this. What I'm going to be showing you is how I use lipstick to create this larger lip look. And as you can tell, my lips look a lot larger than they normally do. So let me take off my lipstick and we'll get started. Okay, let's get started pumping up these lips. Now first I'm going to use a little bit of concealer. Just a little bit to even out the lips and give us a blank canvas to work on. There we go. Now the next thing we're going to do is add a little bit of highlighter on the Cupid's bow. And I'm using the Clinique Chubby Stick. I'm just going to add a little bit of highlighter here just to give us that kind of bee stung look. A little bit down those nasal bumps there, whatever they're called. I'm not sure what they're called. I'm going to dab that in a little bit. Now I'm also going to use a little bit of the Clinique Chubby Stick Contour underneath the lip to kind of make it look like my lower lip is so big it's pillowing out. Dab that in a little bit. Next we're going to go in with a little bit of lip liner and this is the Laura Geller Lip Liner in Spice. And the whole point of this is to start at the outside here but not to overline the outside there because that can make you look like you have duck lips. You don't want those. But just to take it near the edge of the corner and then gradually work it up just a little bit outside of the natural lip line. Just like that. Now where the cupid's bow goes down in the middle, we're not going to let it go as low as it does because that makes a severe kind of thin upper lip. So we're going to bring it up just a little bit. There we go. Now I'll do the lower lip line. Just a little bit outside the natural lip line. Now we're going to bring that lip liner in just a little bit on the outsides. Get a little bit in the middle. A little bit like that. 
Now we're going to go in and smooth that lip liner. So it doesn't have sharp edges. Lips should be soft, not sharp. Now we're going to take the matte portion of this flower lipstick. It's the Mix and Matte Duo, and we're only going to be using the matte side. It's in the color Honey Nude. So there we go. Now we're going to add a little bit of Marc Jacobs Cream and Sugar just to the middle of the lower lip. And then we'll smack our lips together. And that just gives you the finished glossy look. That was a look at how I pumped my lips. And if you're not a subscriber or if you're a visitor from Reese's channel, I hope you'll subscribe and click that little bell. That will just notify you of my future youthing videos. And in addition to subscribing to my channel, I hope you'll click on the link below the video and go visit Risa, tell her hi, and subscribe to her channel too. Now, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and today is no exception. I'm using the Life Loves You cards from Louise Hay. Okay, let's go ahead and pick a card. Okay, I am beautiful and everybody loves me. I am beautiful and everybody loves me. I feel a little conceited to say that. I am beautiful and everybody loves me. Carry this thought with you today and notice the effect on you and others. I absolutely love this card. As we go through our day today, let's be kinder to ourselves and say wonderful things to ourselves like, I am beautiful and everybody loves me. I am beautiful and everybody loves me. I love the sound of that. It feels so good to be a friend to ourselves and say nice things to ourselves instead of criticizing ourselves. So just for today, I hope you'll go through the day today being kinder to yourself and saying, I am beautiful and everybody loves me. I am beautiful and everybody loves me. Because when we're kind to ourselves, we feel good about ourselves and have the energy we need to be kind to others too. Take care. See you next time.